probably a great product for live vocalists and that's what it's intended to do. What can I say about this TC Helicon Voice Live? I've bought two of them. That's what I can say about them. When I first started my first studio back in 2009, I bought this item, but not this one in particular. This eventually burnt out on me probably about a couple years ago. So I went ahead and bought another one off of eBay. And I'll try to leave you some links below to Reverb and eBay where you can get products like the TC Helicon Voice Live. Now, what I'm trying to say is I like this product. Now, granted, it is not like what you're going to do with your software and you can just sing regular and then just uh, edit it later. That's going to be an issue. But even with all that being said, this item does have some great features on it. It's, it's really one of the things I do like about it is the ability to edit while you're singing is probably a great product for live vocalists and that's what it's intended to do is to help you uh, uh, live vocal it has pitch correction it has harmony effects uh, gospel harmony effects it has some sort of dance rave type effects you can even do presets i have never really used the presets because i used it majorly in the studio and we'll go over all that with you and uh, show you how the editing works on this. And then I'll also give you a idea of what this device can do, like I plan to do with all gear processors. This is the introduction, so let's talk about the editing on this machine. As you can see, the presets are there. You have preset selection, key for your songs, the scale, which you can change from minor to so forth. Some of these are presets cannot be messed with. So like, I don't know, is this one, uh, here's the preset and then you get the key. And this one, as you can see, it changes from A major to B major. And then you go to the scale and change it into a uh, minor over down here. So you got, and this has three different presets for minor or you can do custom as well for C as well. Having said all that, then we get into the editing process of this machine. As you see, you hit edit. You have everything to control your harmony. You add the thickness, uh, the FX and a pitch correction, of course. So you can actually, uh, I recommend getting away from the thick because that's what keeps you from sounding really loud and maybe uh, you can do the harmony, of course, will affect your, uh, you know, your, you know, the harmony will affect whether or not the effect is on. You have FX, which is like your reverb and the different things like that. But you keep on going further down the road of, you have the voice enablers, which you have four, up to four, say, channels of different vocals. You can turn one off. And of course you want to position them. You can position them a different way too as you keep on. You can do the voice leveling each of those. Here is where you can put them. You can actually center them. You can put them on the left side of your pen or the right side or you can center. So you have center, right, left and have three vocals as well. Keep on going. You got voicing scale which is this is all custom. So this on this preset, it won't let you edit. And you're going to find that as you go on. Gender, we can be more female or we can be more male on this. Stop uh, being a girly man. Well. And this can affect all of your vocalist vibe style. You have vibretto. You have your different levels modes type and a lot of this stuff do i know what it all means no <laughs> but you do have a latch if you want to continue a little bit more on the vocals but there you go folks i mean this is just it's a device that you can play with and that's what i think i miss about having a, a you know a system like this is you are 
able to play with it. Like the moment you pick it up, you're going to test what your vocals sound like. And so what I'm trying to say is, say you do write music and you have an idea for a certain song, okay? Well, this device will let you play until you find what sounds good. You start singing until and adjusting it until you get to where you want to go. Now, having said that, once you get recorded, you're probably going to have to de-ass it. You're probably going to have to equalize it anyways. Or, and I add my own effects. So one key note I would do if you are recording with advice like this is just immediately turn off the effects. It's not worth playing with. You've got plenty of effects on your Pro Tools or your Reason or any of these other devices. I would recommend just shutting the effects off. This is the most important thing you're looking at. From pitch correction, yes, I want it in the key of the C. I want no effects, no thickness. And I want my harmony because I want the effect to sound. Because if you don't have the harmony on, it's just going to mix with your regular vocals. So uh, what you want to do, you can turn this off, yes. But you need the harmony on to control the person. So if we're just doing one, all right, and we do this. All right, so I have one voice on, off, off. And I've got it in harmony. So this is the guy I'm going to control. Now when I get to editing my own voice, I want this to be on zero. And I want my own voice to be, see where it says lead? I want that off, but I want the harmony. Let me go back to editing. I want the harmony on. Go back here. But see the lead is off. That means my vocals are off. But the harmony stays. So what I want to do is adjust that harmony to zero. Because that's what you do. Now there's an instrument outlet as well. You can have an instrument going through there if you're live. Let's say if you want to go to a concert or you want to perform a concert, I should say. You can hook your acoustic guitar through here. And then have yourself and that guitar line up. So that's something. And as you can see... Uh, with this, this adds the instrument. Let's go back off of here. But you can see the instrument is 30 plus. But I can bring that instrument down. I can control the outlet output of the device as well. So it's not distorted if I'm saying. So it's got a little bit of built in mixing in this. Anyways, that's a little bit about the device. I'm going to give you some samples of what this thing could do because I'm going to record with it today. So, you guys, I will see you in a bit, all right? She says, baby, you can hold me at night. And I will give you some sugar for your milk. He says, baby, you got the best sugar around. He's scrolling through the internet, just a regular guy. Got him in the web, love, he, he had tonight. Found a girl online, an e-girl divine. In a pixelated world, he's gonna blow her mind. Everybody sing with me in this cybernetic jubilee. With the melody that never ends, we'll be Chicken get killed. Willy Wonka and the 